I got my finger on the trigger But I don't know who to trust When I look into your eyes It's just devils in the This is the guitar lesson for Devils and Dust by Bruce Springsteen, the boss, from GuitarMadeEasy.com. All right, the first thing you want to do, kids, is tune your guitar to double drop D. So D, A, D, G, B, D. These two guys are usually E's, but now they're D's. Two parts of this song, it's really easy. Watch me and I'll show you how to play it. The first part is the verse. How we play that is first you want to make a C. You want to move that up two frets. So our C shape is now on the uh, fifth and third fret. So our ring finger is going to go on the fifth fret on the A string. Middle finger is on the fourth fret on the D string. Pointer finger is going to be in the third fret on the B string. It sounds like that. That's the first chord you want to know. The next chord we take our pointer finger and we put that on the second fret on the A string. And that's it. The last chord is just our A major. And you've got yourself a verse. This is how we play it. Now on that very first chord, it's actually a variation of a D chord. What I'm doing is I'm using this strumming pattern. So down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, really slowly. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down. That strumming pattern is actually used throughout the entire song. So learn it, live it, love it. Now on the down downs on this variation of a D chord, I'm putting my pinky on that fifth fret on the D string. Watch very closely. And also notice I'm not strumming uh, all the strings. All I'm strumming are the first three strings. And then occasionally my pick will hit the fourth string, but I'm not going. I'm going. The next chord I go to is my, it's a variation of a G. So it's this chord right here where I take my pointer finger and put that on the second fret on the A string. Now I go back to my variation of a D. Now I go to my A. Back to my D. When you play that D in the middle of the progression, you don't want to put your pinky on it. So after you go from the G, when you go to the D again, you don't put your pinky on that fifth fret on the D string. You just leave it off. That's the verse, guys. That's half the song. That's half the battle right there. Now, one thing I want to tell you really quick before we go into the second part of the song is as this song goes on, you want to create like a buildup. So when it starts off, you want to mute the strings a lot with your palm. And you also want to make sure that you play kind of soft. And then as the song gradually progresses, you want to get louder and you want to take your palm off the strings. The second part I'm going to show you is kind of like a pre-chorus, chorus, chorus uh, kind of deal. Uh, I don't know what you call it, but it's just the second part you got to know to, to learn how to play this song. It's the part where he goes, I got God on my side. And I'm going to walk through the chords with you. So I've got God on my side. What that chord is right there is, is a, it's a variation of, I believe, a G. And what we're doing is we're taking our pointer finger, putting that on the third fret on the B string. Pinky's going to go on the fifth fret on the A string. And our middle, or I'm sorry, our ring finger is going to go on that, what was once E and is now a D string. So, I've got God on my side. 
and I'm just trying to survive. And then we switch to, it's a variation of a D chord. So that's our pointer finger on the second fret G string, uh, middle finger on the third fret B string, ring finger on the fourth fret on the E, which is now a D. But if what you do to survive, this is a variation of an E, which all I'm doing is I'm on the second fret with my pointer finger on the E, which is now a D, and then my middle finger on the second fret on the A string. Everything else is open. Kills the things that you love, A. Just our regular A. And then fear's a powerful thing. This is also a variation of a G. It's our pointer finger on the second fret A string, ring finger on the third fret B string. Everything else is open. Back to our D. Can turn your heart black, you can trust. Back to our D. It'll take your God-filled soul. That's the chord we used in the verse where all it is is our pointer finger on the second fret A string. And then we go to our A chord. And fills it with devils and dust back into the verse of the song. That's it guys, two parts to this one. It's really not a hard song to learn how to play. It's fun to sing along with and to pretend you're Bruce Springsteen. Um, seriously, if you guys have a great Bruce Springsteen impression, I'd love to see it. Uh, Jimmy Fallon does a really good one. Uh, makes me laugh, so anyway. Thanks for watching my videos, guys. Make sure to subscribe and also spread the word about Guitar Made Easy via social media. Sign up for my free email list now and I'll send you my top secret guitar tips absolutely free. These tips will motivate you, keep you interested in guitar playing, and will help you become a better guitarist overall. But wait, if you sign up right now, I'll throw in all this stuff and it's all for free. All you have to do is go to signup.guitarmadeeasy.com and sign up to kickstart your guitar playing. And last, if you like my videos, you'll love the way I can teach you guitar. Please go to teachmeguitar.guitarmadeeasy.com where learning the guitar has never been easier. Thanks for watching everyone and keep rocking.